we're going to learn the ladder method used for division. The first thing we need to do is create our toolbox. It is these tools we will use to solve our problem. Our tools are one, two, five, and 10. Since we're dividing by three, we're gonna multiply each of these tools by three. And we'll go ahead and draw our ladder. All right, and we wanna go as big as we can. So right away I notice that there's another tool that I could add to my toolbox that would be really helpful this pro for this problem. And that is 100, because I know 100 times three is 300. And since this is a large number, that's gonna help me work smarter, not harder. So the first tool I'm gonna use is 100. I like to use the largest tool that I can. And 100 times three gives me 300. So I subtract the 300, and that leaves me 57. So I can't use 100 again. I look to the next largest tool, which is a 10. And 10 times three gives me 30, so I'm gonna use 10. 10 times three, and that leaves me 27. So I notice I can't use 10 again, so then I'll use the five. And subtract 15, because three times five is 15. That leaves me with 12. So I cannot use the five again, so I'll use the two. And two times three gives me six, so I'll subtract six. <clears throat> 12 minus six leaves me with six, so I'll use that two again. It's important to know I can use the same tool over and over again. So I'll just subtract the six because two times three is six, and then I end with zero. So my work is done for the day. I need to collect my tools and add them up. 110, 15, 16, and that gives me 119. So 357 divided, divided by three is 119.